So, something you guys hear about us, hear us talk about all the time uh, through all these videos is going to be time under tension. Quality. Quality over quantity. Right. So, something that a lot of people don't understand is the longer you keep the muscle under tension, the harder it's going to work. And the more muscle activation you're going to get. Right. So, doing something like taking a 25 pound dumbbell, if it's too heavy for you, I'm just going to give you an example real quick. You know, you're doing, say you're doing a curl. You got two dumbbells in your hand. If you over here swinging that around, you're not even using your muscles. You're using gravity, inertia, and all that to get that weight up. So like, go ahead, here, I'm gonna have you demonstrate. So when you're doing like, you know, a bicep curl or whether it's whatever workout it is, the longer you keep that muscle under tension, the more motor units you're gonna recruit, the more muscle fibers are gonna be, uh, the more, the harder they're gonna be working. So give them an idea of like something. The time with pitch curl. Right. So right. for it's a time with pitch curl. Nice and easy, it's not hard, you're just gonna work a little hard. Right. So you're gonna curl. And on your way down, you're not gonna do this. Because a lot of people just do that. Right. You curl, and then drop it kind of slow. Mm -hmm. Now something most people don't know either is that, go back up to the, the concentric portion all the way at the top. So during that eccentric portion of the, the, that, that curl right there where he's stretching that muscle out, you actually get about 10 to 15% more muscle recruitment and more muscle fiber recruitment than you do during the concentric portion. Mm -hmm. And that's for every exercise. Because you're fighting the weight down. Right, gravity is working against you. You've got other factors in play other than just trying to pick it up. Mm -hmm. So like if you're doing a shoulder press, it's the same idea on the way up. You're not getting as much muscle activation on the way down. Keep that nice and slow. Maybe three. Three, three four three. second count. Yeah, three, four second count. Like one, two, three, one, two, three. For the sake of it, next time you guys do a workout, take every bit of weight you did in the last workout, drop it by five, ten percent, but double the time under tension, and tell me you're not dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For real. And you get bigger pumps this week, too. Really? Big pumps. The biggest pumps you have ever got. Really? You really will. You'll feel swole. Mm -hmm. You'll feel swole. Like, you know, I've got, I work with a lot of older older people at my, at my work called Osteo Strong. A lot of the time they ask me for workout and exercise tips because they know it's something I'm passionate about and I've been doing for a long time. And all the time is control weight, time under tension. Every time they come back in, they're, they're not happy with me <laughs> because they're sore. Like they worked that much harder, but they really didn't work that much harder. It's working smarter. And, harder. and like for shoulders time under tension shoulder workout. Mm -hmm. So whenever you're doing raises, you know what I'm saying? Some people just forget, pump them out, you know what I'm saying? Some people just be like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't doing nothing. Right. You ain't gonna be sore if you work out. You ain't gonna get a pump. Uh -uh. None of that. You know, not enough muscle activation to build a substantial amount of muscle. Mm -hmm. So you gotta control it, you know what I'm saying? Up and fight it all the way down. Fight it all the way down. You'll be able to do half his breath, not less than half, you know what I'm saying, than just pump it. Right. And you get a better workout. Right. Keep with less slow, sets. Slow, control. Yeah. Uh, keep the movements good. If you got to drop weight to do it, do it because you will be burning. Mm -hmm. And it yeah. does burn, boys. Right. And the more you tear the muscle apart, the more you can feed it nutrients so it can grow larger. Yep. It's simple, easy stuff. A lot of people don't know it. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's time under tension. Try it out. Tell us what you think. Yeah, let me know.